Hello, this is Maya broadcasting out the UK and today is Monday movie and today's shave is going to be a UK soap and we're talking about check and speak number 88 and this is the box it comes in and this is how it's wrapped and this is what it looks like I have taken bits off I always take bits off out the of the back oh, and it smells gorgeous it smells so good what is in here bergamot geranium rose otto cassie frangipani uh, vertiva sandalwood and oak moss <coughs> it is really really lovely but you need to like a little bit of the rose floral scent it's not strong as in the rose part but it is there and it is super hard so I am blooming mine here you go <coughs> oh, look at me spilly water all over here yeah, I'm blooming it in my shave bowl and all down my front look at me I'm going to be smelling nice for the rest of the day um yeah the razor I am using it's the um, Edward X Jacob vintage style in white and it has the Wilkinson sword blade in it on its fourth use and the brush that I'm using is the DS Cosmetics Mixed Ball Brush Ball and Badger and I'm not sure what the millimeter is I think it is a 24 if I'm not mistaken so let's get on to lathering and I'll be back once I've done that there we go so I have whipped up my lather here it is beautiful look at that right let's get my face wet and then let's do the first pass right i've got cold water today it's a warm day it's sunny absolutely beautiful today there we go and let's get going always turns out a bit wet because the brush is not broken in thoroughly yet so it will be of a wetter nature especially if I've bloomed the soap with quite a bit of water doesn't take anything from the protection nor the slip nor the actual performance of the soap here we go first pass with the grain for those that haven't been to my video channel before and don't know about this razor this is a cheap razor well this there are different makes from this company and they cost from four pound to about nine pound they come with a box and with blades Derby blades normally oh that was so smooth was I actually in the picture? What's happening today? And it has a DE89 head. So, which makes it a fabulous beginner. And for those that want to hone in onto their technique, because the head you can put in mild blades and or sharp blades as you go along and get more experienced and more 
and are confident. This brush has superb backbone. It's perfect for a real stubble. At the moment it's not super soft, as I said it's not broken in yet. Now I'm going to go across the grain. East to west and west to east. Nearly shaved that off. My head hair. There you go. Uh, the scent strength is medium to strong on this soap. And this is such a smooth and lovely shave. It's really enjoyable. So last pass. I won't even need a pick up on this one. It really does the job well. And it's a real, real luxury scent this. old-fashioned but in a nice way right now I'm going from south to north against the grave from chin to nose so much you don't see check and speak shown a lot on YouTube well, I don't know many that have used it let's say that way around I don't know why because it is an English company as well known as Taylor of Bond Street and Floris and um, D.R. Harris. It's an old standing company. And it works fabulously, the soap. Ah, oh, and I've still got quite a lot of lather left. Look at that. Loads of lather left. And. and <laughs> And my basin is awful of lava as well. I managed to make a humongous mess today. But I don't mind. The scent is just so beautiful. The whole bathroom is just wafting <laughs> with beautiful scents. I'm just adding this into my soap bowl for later use. And you can see how much this actually is. This would be most probably an, at least one more pass for a beardy pass and two more for me uh, at least. And you'll see in a second all the lather. Look at that. You see? It's a lot. So we'll close that off that none of that scent goes mm, I'm a bit I like keeping it right and post shave is the aloe first with healing herbs super close
Lotus and Baby Smooth without any, um, not over shaven, no irritation to the skin, not too rough, so the blade combination was perfect. And now I'm putting on some aloe moisturizing lotion. This is the one that has a slight fragrance but contains no lanolin at all. There we go. So I'm picking up on the floral a little bit today. But if you'd use an aftershave with sandalwood or vertebra, it would just be more earthy and that would be also a fabulous scent but today I'm feeling like a little bit more floral I don't use floral very often so this is a great treat and then I'm going to put on excuse the noise Floris a rose for you so this is rose scent Floral Oriental, Top Notes Darjeeling Tea, Incense, Cassis, Red Rose, Oris, Oud, Sandalwood, Patchouli and Vanilla. So let's go, let's finish this off. Oh yes, this is a real treat. This is really, really nice without being over the top. And it, as I've tried this before, it will develop over the day and you will get different scents throughout the day and it will really bring out your own body scent and it will be unique to you. So I hope you enjoyed that and I will be seeing you hopefully on Wednesday when it will be Wednesday Watch and I hope I've planned something nice for you. So have a lovely week. Don't get stressed. Be safe. And tune in on Wednesday. See you soon. And I'm already missing you. Bye bye.